majalisa da tattalin arziki ta kasa ta shawarci shugabatun buye da katar da harajin bat babu wahalar samun mai daga matatar mu inji aliko dangwati ji duriyar manoma 21 da yan bindiga suka sace a jahar Kebeba in ji wasu manoma kamfanin NNPCL bai ba mu izinin bayar da lalamman fetar kai tsaye ba in ji matatar Aliko Dangwati bangar labarin kasashen waje za ku yi cewa an kama shahararru masu amfani da shafukan yanar gizo a kasar Tunisia a tajiriya a kasar Amurka Elon Musk ya ki bayyana a gaban kotu kan tuhumar baiwa masu zabe cin hanci na mako don ku To jama'a assalamu alaikum barkamu da sake kasance da ku a cikin wani sabon shirin na labarun kaftan tv tare da ni Yahya Hassan Iyatawa yanzu kuma ga labarun dalla dalla majalisar tattalin arziki ta kasa wato NEC a takaice ta bayyana cewa an ba lewar ta auko a Najeriya a bana ta shafi kananan hukumi 217 na jihohin Najeriya guda 34 inda a kalla mutum 321 suka rasa rayukan su majalisar ta bayyana haka ne inda kuma ta karar cewa an balar ta shafi a kalla mutum miliyan 1.372 sannan ta raba a kalla mutum 1743 daga mahallansu gwamnatin jahar annabara gwamnatin jahar annabara professor chukuma saludu shi ya bayyana haka a lokacin da yake zanta da manema labarai a fadar shugaban kasa bayan taron na majalisar tattalin arziki ta kasa wanda mutumin shugaban kasa Kashim Shatima ya jagoranta Chukuma Saludu ya bayyana cewa an ba liyar ta jikkata a kalla kimanin mutum miliyan 2854 sannan kuma ta barna ta gidaje 2281 da kuma ka dada ta filin noma 2258 na gonaki a fadin Najeriya to a wani labarin kuma majalisar tattalin arzikin Najeriya to NEC ta shawarci shugaban kasa Bola Ahmad Tinubu da ya janye kudirin yi wa Harajin Bat garin Bawal da aiki majalisar dokoki ta kasa domin a samu isashen lokacin da za a tattauna tare da fahimtar juna game da abin da yake nufi gyara Harajin Bat wanda ya aiki tunda fargo dai gwamnonin arewa da sarakunan yankin arewacin Najeriya sun yi zama na musamman a jahar Kaduna tare da wasu masu rada saki a yankin inda suka yi fatali da wannan kudirin garin Bawal na tattalin na Harajin da shugaban kasa Bola Ahmad Tinubu ya aiki majalisar dokoki da shi majalisar ta bayyana haka ne bayan zaman ta na 145 a karshen jagorancin mutumin shugaban kasa Kashu Shatima wanda a gudanar a birnin Abuja fadar gwamnatin Najeriya majalisar ta dauki wannan matakin ne bayan shugaban kwamitin shugaban kasa na musamman kan tsare tsare da yiwa Haraji Garin Bawal Mr. Teo Oedeli wanda ya gabatar jawabi game da tsare tsare da suke inda majalisar ta bayyana cewa akwai bukatar a samu karin lokaci domin tattauna da fahimtar juna ha kuma Kashu Shatima ya bayyana cewa za su dauki matakai da suka dace domin tabbatar da ba a sake samu irin wannan katsayar lantarki da aka fuskanta ba a kwanakin baya a yankin arewacin Najeriya to anan kuma hukumar ke hadurra ta tarayyar Najeriya reshen jahar reshen kalmar hukumar nasara dake jahar nasara ta karrama mai martaba sarkin nasara Alhaji Ibrahim Usman Jibril CON tare da nadashi a matsayin honorary special marshal kuma babban patron na yankin nasara unit command Aisha to idris loko na dauke da cikakken hotun hukumar kiyaye hadura ta tarayya reshen karamar hukumar nasarawa ta karrama mai martaba sarkin nasarawa alhaji ibrahim usman jibrin con tare da nadashi a matsayin honorary special marshal wannan karramawar ta kasance ne a yayin wata ziyarar girmamawa da tawagar hukumar karkashin jagorancin shugaban rukon kwariya na shiyar CRC Samuel Malcolm Ako suka kai wa sarkin a fadar sa dake cikin garin Nasarawa a ranar talata 29 ga watan Oktoba 2024
I, Usman Jibri, Commander of the Border of the Niger CON, National Special Marshal of the Federal Rose of Tinko. Your Honor, this morning, based on your approval, I'm happy to announce the presence of the Unit Commander, CRS MS Apo with the Unit Commander Federal Receptico RS 4.33 Nasra Unit Command. Tawakar Tahada da SRC Zainab Bawa, Babban Commandant Hanya, Jamai wasu Special Marshals da kuma matasa yan bautar kasa na NYSC. SRC Zainab Bawa. Then we have also the training officer in our mission. Uh, Mr. Uh, SRC Bishop. Commandant Ako ya bayyana cewa babban manufar ziyarar ita ce ta memar ta ba sarkin Nasarawa murna bisa na din da aka yi masa a matsayin honorary special marshal wanda babban commander rundunar cops marshal ya bashi a ranar 9 ga watan satumbar shekarar 2024 ya ce wannan karramawa tana nuna kokarin sarkin wajen tabbatar da tsaron hanya da cigaban al'umma Commandant Ako ya kuma gode wa sarkin bisa kulawar sa ga jin dadin jama'a da karfafa tsaron hanya yana mai cewa wannan tsari na special marshal zai kara samar da ingantaccen tsaro a hanyoyin yankin a karshe commandant ya mika wa sarkin kwafi na ka'idojin special marshal da kundin titunan hanya Amartanin sa mai martaba sarkin Nasarawa ya gode mu hukumar bisa wannan karramawar da aka yi masa ya tabbatar wa commandant da cewa masarautar za ta ci gaba da goyen bayan hukumar dan tabbatar da tsaron hanya a yankin Mai Nasarawa ya kuma yin amfani da wannan damar dan shawartar hukumar da ta ƙara himma wajen fadakar da jama'a musamman a lokutan environment don rage haddura da kiyaye tsaro a tituna These are critical moments in the whole of this country because in this month we will tend to be in a rush as if they are being invited to go to him Shugaban sashe na daya Malam Aliyu mai dodo ya kuma godewa sarkin Nasarawa bisa amincewar sa da zama patron na special marshal a Nasarawa unit command tare da jaddada muhimmancin wannan matsayi wajen tabbatar da tsaron hanya Karshen rahoton kenan Aisha to Idris Loko labaran Kaftan TV Hausa daga karamar hukumar Nasarawa jihar Nasarawa Kanan kuma yayin da aka dawo harkokin karatu a Jami'ar Jihar Gombe Commissioner Ilwe mai zurfi na Jihar Gombe Muhammad Shatima Gaidan ya yi kira ga iyaye da sutura ayyan su su kuma makaranta dan kala samun cigaban harkokin karatu ga madarakar ilimin ga dai rahotun da wakilin mu Muhammad Ibrahim Fantami ya aiko mana idan da za a iya tunawa amma kwanjiya ne kungiyar malaman Jami'a na Jihar ta Gombe ta takatar da yajin aiki da dundumai ya tun watan satumbar wannan shekara hakan yasa mukaddashin mataimakin shugaban jami'a ta Jihar Gombe wato Acting Vice Chancellor a Turance Professor Sada Ahmed Yauta ya sanar da cewa an dawo cigaba harkokin karatu a jami'a inda yake jawabi game da malabaru a dakin taro na sanar chamba a Turance na wannan jami'a inda ya ba mu gwamnatin Jihar Gombe saboda biyan bukatu da yana malaman na jami'a da sauran kungiyoyi na jami'ar da yasa suka dakatar da yajin aikin da ya ba da jami'a cigaba da karatu 
kumayo uh, senate na university tazona kumata bada approval aganchi wa ya rasudao ndaga yo ashirinda tukwas gawata uh, gawata mkuma dugu biuda ashirinda hudu zaku ya tuna wa akanchi wa uh, gomneti njahar gombe kakashi njago ranching alhaji muhammadu inu wa ya haya ta bawa jamia njahar gombe milian eri biuda hamsin uh, 2021 uh, shekaru na dubu biuda ashirinda daya saboda subia wensu allowance na malamai uh, one day kama daga dubu biuda shabiu dubu biuda shabiar dukuma dubu biuda shashida wana allowance zing ambayar kuma amibia sana kuma sh gomle di tasaki, tasaki bawa uh, ite jamiar malaka njahar gombe kuna de wanda suka kama miliyan 1551 da tafara aiki a sangayen karatu na dukku wanda muke ce mata Gombe State University Dukku Campus kuma muna gayawa al'umma akan cewa wannan campus din na Gombe na Dukku insha Allah nan ba da dadewa ba muna tunanin nan zuwa November December za fara karatu anan sangayar da take da duku professor Sani Ahmad Dauta ya kuma kara da cewa wannan gwamnati ta yi bayan wannan hubba Sani da gwamnati ta yi ta sake ba da sati daya da ya wuce ta ba da kudi na kimanin naira miliyan 532 saboda a biya allowance allowance na na malamai malamai da wanda ba malamai ba kuma wannan gudun an bayar an ya proven an turo mana university kuma mu ma mun mika shi ga malaman mu da kuma maikatan mu da suke aiki a university sannan kuma kun sani cewa gwamnati ta sake kara mana dama tana ba mu miliyan 200 a kowane wata yanzu mun yi complaint sannan ta kara mana miliyan 50 akai akan wannan kudin da ake bin mu so wannan kudin kuma an kara shine saboda uh, ana tunanin zai iya biyan 2535 uh, consequential adjustment na albashi Muhammad Ibrahim Pantami labarun captain TV Hausa daga Gombe to anan kuma matatar mai ta Aliko Dangote ta mayar da martani ga kungiyar da lalamman Peter Ipman wannan ta bayyana cewa mun boban ta suna kwashe kwanaki a matatar man ba tare da sun samu yallodi ba matatar ta bayyana haka ne a wata sanarwa da jami'in hulla da jama'a na matatar Antoni Cejina ya fitar inda ya kara da cewa babu babu kudin da yan kungiyar da suka bada ga wato ga matatar mai ta Aliko Dangote kamar yadda ya bayyana jami'in ya kara cewa muna kara da nata cewa zamu iya wadatar da Najeriya da albarkatun man Peter irin su man Peter da diesel da ko man jirgin sama da dai sauran su ayan zaka da zamu iya loda trailer 2900 a kowace rana kuma muna fitar da man Peter na jirgin ruwa muna ba yan kungiyar Ipman shawara sai ya register da mu kai tsaye kuma su fara cin albarkatun man Peter din kai tsaye daga wajen mu don muna da wadatar man Peter da suke bukata kamar yadda mai magana da yawan matatar mai ta Aliko Dangote ya bayyana to anan kuma kamfanin da ke rarraba wata lantarki a Najeriya to TCN a take ce ya bayyana cewa wuta ta samu a wasu jihohin arewa da suka hada da jahar Kano da jahar Nasarawa da jahar Benue da jahar Kaduna da Bauchi da jahar Gombe bayan gyara da aka yi musu kamfani ya bayyana cewa wutar ta samu ne bayan aiki a layin a layin afir lafiya bayan da daya daga cikin layikan da suke dauke da suke bada wuta na shururo ugaji suka lalace inda kuma TCN din ya bayar ya bayar da tabbacin cewa jami'an sana aiki a dai layin domin tabbatar da kowane gari ya samu talantarki a fadin Najeriya wannan dai na zuwa ne a dai lokacin da to yankin na Arewa ya kwashe kwanaki kutan gu ya kwashe kwanaki fiye da goma ba tare da samu talantarki ba al'amuran da janyo tseko a fannonin aiki da kasuwanci da maharkokin kiwon lafiya a yankin Arewacin Najeriya 
to anan kuma bayani na bayani cewa ana can ana cikin damuwa danganar batun wasu manunwa guda 21 da yan bindiga suka sace a garin Bena na yankin kalmar hukumar Danko suku na jahar Kebbi an dai sace manoman ne yayin da suke aiki a gonakin su a farkon wannan makon jama'ar yankin na Danko suku ta gabas sun kwashe tsawon a kallon shekara 5 suna fama da wannan matsala ta harharar yan bindiga da kuma garkuwa da mutane tunda farko da yan bindigar sun sace manoman daga gonakin su a garin Bena na yankin kalmar hukumar Danko suku ta jahar Kebbi inda ake wato inda ake dakon jin duriyar manoman da kuma inda aka nufa da su amma an bayyana cewa har yanzu ba amu ba labari a cewa wasu jama'a da suke da suke zauna a yankin matsalar hararan yan bindiga da ake kaiwa a yankin arewacin Najeriya da kuma yankin na Baina ta kai inta kamar yadda wani mazaunin yankin ya bayyana to anan kuma a kokarin tabbatar da ganin an fara harkokin karatu a tsangiyar kimiyar mahalli ta jami'ar Jahar Gombe dake kalmar hukumar Dukku wata ta waga ta musamman ta jami'ar ta ziyarci tsangiyar ta Dukku domin ganin abubuwan da ke faruwa da idanta Muhammad Ibrahim Fantami na dauke da karshar hotel da yake magana da manema labaru yayin ziyarar a tsangiyar jami'ar Jahar ta Gombe a Dukku farfesa Sani Ahmad Yauta muqaddashin matamakin shugaban jami'ar ya ce ziyarar wani bangare ne na shirye-shirye da hukunta jami'ar suke yi na tabbatar da ganin an fara karatu a tsangiyar a watan Disabar wannan shekara kuma ziyarar za ta ba su damar ganin abubuwa da da inganta su shi faculty of environmental sciences uh faculty day wanda zai housing programs guda hudu a musamu bac architecture bac building technology bac quantity survey da kuma bac estate management wayan nan program guda hudu da girwa sune zamu fara kaddamarwa a wannan college Alhaji Muhammad Chichi Magadan Commission Ilimi Zubi na Jahar Gombe ya kasance a tsangiyar yayin wannan ziyara ga kuma lokacin sa kan tsangiyar a dafa da wannan makaranta din ba tare da jima'a ba a fara karatu so insha Allah kamar yadda kuka mu a yanzu mun zo ne mu kawo ziyara wa shi sarki mu masa kaiso ban girma kamun a shi wannan sakin a ji aduba Alhaji Abdul Qadir Harun Rashid mai martaba sarkin Dukku da Alhaji Adamu Muhammad Waziri shugaban karamar hukumar Dukku dukkanin sun bayyana farin cikin su gwamnatin Jihar Gombe saboda samu da tsangiyar a garin Dukku lamar da suka ce zai kara karfa goyo al'umma su mata nan kuran karkara su kara jajir cewa a gogon wayar fidar ilimi suna gode muku daukan lokaci musamman ku zo nan don ku mana bayar su da musamman sannan kuma mu je har da kumuwa mu ga abubuwan da suke gudana muhammad Ibrahim Pantami labarun kaftan TV Hausa daga Gombe To anan kuma matacar mai ta Aliko Dangote ta bayyana cewa har yanzu bata karbi kudi daga kungiyar dalalman Peter ta Najeriya ba wato Ikma domin Simon Peter din kai tsaye a cikin wata sanwa da matatar ta Aliko Dangote ta bayyana a shafin ta na Twitter ta bayyana cewa ana tattauna da Ikma sai dai ta bayyana cewa bai dace mambobin Ikma sun nuna cewa ba su ba su fuskantar wato suna fuskantar matsala wajen center ta cin min fitar daga matatar ta Aliko Dangote ba wanda aka bayyana cewa harkoki ne na kasuwanci a cewa matatar mai ta Aliko Dangote cikin wata sanwa da jami'inta na hullar jama'a Antoni Cejina ya sanyawa hannu ya bayyana cewa an biya kudin da ake magana ne kai tsaye ta hannun kamfanin mai na kasa NPCL ba matatar mai ta Aliko Dangote ba kamfanin mai na kasa NPCL bai amince da kudin wato bai bada kudin kai tsaye ba kuma ba kuma ba a bada izinin a sayar da man Peter kai tsaye ga su yan kungiyar ta dalalan man Peter ba matatar ta Aliko Dangote ta bayyana cewa muna san mujaddada cewa za mu iya wadatar da Najeriya da albarkatun man Peter har ma da man jirgi kamar yadda jami'in ya bayyana a shafin ta na Twitter to anan kuma gwamnatin jihar Kaduna malam uba Saniya amince da naira 72 a matsayin mafi gankatar albashi ga ma'aikatan jihar a cikin wata 
a cikin wata sanarwa da sakataren watsa labarai na jihar Ibrahim Musa ya fitar ya bayyana cewa karin zai fara aiki daga watan November dake tafi sanarwar ta kara cewa gwamnatin zai kuma samar da motocin sufuri kyauta ga ma'aikatan jihar ta hanyar ba su motoci guda 100 masu amfani da iskar gas domin kai sojan aiki da kuma mayar da su to anan kuma wani malami a bangaren tarihi na jami'ar jihar Gombe professor Isaac Edibe ya bayyana cewa taron bita da aka shirya wa special mashal a jihar Gombe da kuma kullo da fasahar zamani wurin kiyaye faruwar hatsira abin yabawa ne matuka daga jihar Gombe wakilin Muhammad Ibrahim Fantami na dauke da karshen hotun Musta Sansan Kaura da yake magana da mane ma labaru ya ce ilmantar da jama'a da hukuma za su ci gaba da ƙara kaimi akai yana da matukar alfanu wurin ganin an rage yawan faruwar hatsira domin akwai bukatar ilmantar da al'umma su fahimci muhimmancin kiyaye faruwar hatsira da bin dokokin tuki domin kawo saukin faruwar hatsira a Najeriya da ke asarar rai kar dukiyoyin jama'a ba gairawa dalili muna da abubuwa da yawa musamman a kowace rana muna da program da muke zuwa a Aira Kujia da Radio ko masalatai ko choci ko tsashin mota ko wace safiya kafin patotin su fita sai sun shiga wurin tishar motoci da mensu da kuma da kada drawo bi da ko basujoji game da bin dokokin wanda suka kawo yawan hadaya nan jihar Gombe a ganya bude da lalakin shi shi overload wanda kuma shi da gaskiya a kuma mutu kokarin domin mu dakilar da shi wannan na overload na ga mutane har a bayan food na mota an dide su in ka tabo su sai muka gari da zafi ka da gari da zafi abu ne wanda ake cewa ka duba cost benefit analysis kai ka duba ga duba ka ga hatsari da kuma tsalin sistemin nan mota Muhammad Ibrahim Fantami labarun kaftan TV Hausa daga Gombe to anan kuma ministan birnin Abuja ya samu wiki ya bayyana cewa daga watan janairun shekara 2025 duka ababan hawa da ake hawa da su a birnin za su kasance jami'an sanda da nasaran farin kaya na da cikakken bayanan su ministan wiki ya bayyana haka ne a lokacin da yake ba da tallafin su bin motoci na haya ga wasu matasa a birnin Abuja ministan ya kuma zargi wasu masu amfani da ababan hawa da kasancewa masu yi wa yan bindiga leken hasiri mafiyo masu tuka ke kena fa da koma su yawo da ca da koma su a caba suna bayo yan bindiga bayanan asiri ne don haka daga watan janairun sabuwar shekara babu wanda za mu bari ya dauki passenger a motar sa ba tare da samun sahalar jami'an tsaro na farin kaya ba da kuma na yan sanda sanan dole kuma a yi wa motocin da ake da ake haya da su rajista in ji minista wiki ministan na birnin Abuja ya kara cewa za mu bari a sake amfani da kowace irin mota ba ta dukar passenger ba tare da an samu cikakken bayanan ta ba ministan ya ci gaba da cewa za mu dauki bayanan direba da motar sa kamar da sunan direba da lambar motar sa da sauran muhimmin bayanan sa suke da rajista in ji minista wiki to anan kuma majalisar dattije ta shirya kurekurar kwamitin da zai gudanar da bincike kan zargin yin zaban kasa ga harkokin Manfetar a Najeriya Mati makin shugaban majalisar dattije sanata Baraw Jibrin shi ya tsarar da hakan a lokacin zaman majalisar bayan da shugaban kwamitin OPM ba mu da leye dauki matakin kudurin wanda ke neman majalisar da kuma majalisar dokoki ta kasa da su gudanar da binciken na hadin kuya shugaban kwamitin ya bayyana cewa majalisar wakili ta gudanar da muhawara akan batun wanda ita ma ta shirya kwamitin da zai bincike akan wannan al'amari na yi wa tattalin arzikin kasa zagon kasa Sanata Baraw Jibrin ya kuma nemi sa hada hannu tare da sanyawa kwamitin suna kwamitin hadin guya na majalisar da zai bincike kan zargin zagon kasa a masana antar Manfetar haka nan kuma ya nemi majalisar wakilan ta zabi adadin mambobin da za su yi aikin daidai da abin da majalisar dattawan ta samar to anan kuma komandan kiyaye hadin rana tare na Najeriya reshen jihar Gombe Mr. Samson Kaura ya bayyana cewa hukumar za ta ci gaba da ruban ya kokarinta wajen ilmantar da jama'a kan muhimmancin kiyaye ka'idojin tuki daga jihar Gombe Muhammad Ibrahim Fantami ya aika mana da wannan rahotin Professor Isaac Adebi ya zanta shi da mune ma labaru jin kadan bayan ya gabatar da kasida shi mai taken fasar zamani wurin rage faruwar hatsira a yayin wani taron bita da aka shirya ma jami'a na musamman da kiyaye faruwar hatsira da ake ci special mashal a turanci na hukumar kiyaye faruwar hatsira ta kasa ya ce Fasa zamani ya kawo sauye sauye a fannonin rayuwa daban-daban musamman ma wurin rage faruwar hatsira so wannan conference yanda za a samu a gaya masu sabbin marshals hanyoyi wanda za daga rage hasari bisa ga 
technological development on the Aki Aki Dashi. So Masama Abende is a Makazuki. Professor Isaac Edebe, Yakumak Ara and Chewa. Shall I? Masama is also collaborating with the Federal Road Safety Corps. They are there like partners. They are by way of the Marshall Sikhi, the Bank, the Abunda Road Safety Sikhi, the Bamba. Kawai Aikin Shine, Arege, Hasari, Akahanya, Kumamutani, Suihankali, Yende Sikhi, Tuki, Suna Afanida, Suma Suna, the Su Motochi. Muhammad Ibrahim Pantami, Navarun Captain TV Hausa, Nega Gombi. To kuna shalla baran da rahoton nan kai tsaye daga nan sashin Hausa na gidan television na Captain TV dake nan birin tarayya Abuja yanzu kuma zamu je ga labarun kasashen waje Hausa wa kan ce abu na gari farin jinin al'umma a yanzu haka ga garumar tashar television ta Captain TV ta fara yada shirye-shiryen ta da harshen Hausa masu ilmantarwa fadakarwa nishadantarwa da kayatarwa wadanda suka kunshi ingantattun labaru da rahotanni da harkokin siyasa Tarihi da al-adumu sana oi pinapinang hausa da wako kimu na gargajia. Haka zalika da shire shire na musamman domi mata da matasa da kanana nyara. Tashar Kaptan TV za tarika ya da shire shire na tazua ko ina afani ndunia tarida kwa raruma aikata da ingancha tunka yang aiki na zamani. Akan tashar tauraron dan Adam ta Star Times a channel DTT142 da DTH414. Ina yan uwa ma abota shirye-shiryen Hausa. Tashar television ta Captain TV ta yunkuro da karfin ta domin gamsar da ku. Tashar Captain TV sabuwar duniya a tare da ku. To anan kuma an bayyana cikin shugaban kasar Senegal Basiru Diome Faye tare da mai dakin sa sun ziyarci dakin Kaaba bayan bayan sauke umarar da suke a kasar ta Makka akan dai wata karamawa ce daga yariba mai jiran gado Muhammad bin Salman na kasar Saudi an kuma wallafa a hotun a shafin shugaban kasar na Senegal a lokacin da ya shiga cikin dakin na Ka'aba to anan kuma rahotanni na bayyana cikin an kama su shahararru masu amfani da shafukan sa da zumunta a kasar Tunisia saboda wallafa bidiyo da ake gani ya ci karo da tarbiya a kasar ta Tunisia kafafun yada labari a kasar sun ce daya daga cikin wadanda aka tsare na da mabiya sama da miliyan 1 a shafukan Instagram an kuma kawo matar wadda aka fi sani da Lady Samara a shafukan yanar gizo kan zarge kan yin zarge zarge shiga ta rashin da'a ma'aikatar shari'a ta Tunisia a farkon watannan ta sanar da cewa za a doki matakin shari'a kan masu amfani da shafukan sa da zumunta da suke bayyana 200 na rashin da'a a kasar ta Tunisia Masu suka kalla marin sun bayyana cewa yin hakan wani bangare ne na yunkurin murkushe in adawa da gwamnati a kasar ta Tunisia. To anan kuma hukumar kula da abinci ta majalisar dinkin duniya ta yi gargadin cewa matsalancin yiwa za ta barke ga kasashe guda 10 guda 16 cikin watanni 8 masu zuwa. Wato a cikin watanni masu zuwa sun bayyana cewa yankunan Palestina da Sudan da kuma Sudan ta Kudu da Mali da kasar Haiti za su fuskantar wannan matsala sauran kasashen da matsalancin yiwa za ta iya ta azara sun hada da Najeriya da kasar Chadi da Yemen da kuma kasar Mozambique da Myanmar da Syria da kuma kasar Lebanon rikice rikice shine babban abin da ke haddasa yiwa ko kuma aka san samun yiwa a wadannan kasashe da hukumar kula da abinci ta majalisar dinkin duniya ta bayyana sunayensu a karara Gwamnatin Safaniya ta bayyana cewa harkawa yanzu ba a gano gaban mutane ba bayan da an ba liyar ruwa ta abu a cikin wannan mako a kasar ta Safaniya an dai bayyana cewa kimanin mutum 160 ne suka rasa ransu a kasar ta Tunisia sakamakon a kasar ta Safaniya sakamakon an ba liyar ruwan wani minista a kasar Angel wato Victor Torres ya bayyana cewa wato zai wa gane irin barnar da an ba liyar ruwan ta da sakawo yanzu Rahotanni dai sun bayyana cewa akwai tashin hankali sosai akan wadannan ibtilai da ya faru a kasar ta Safaniya. An bayyana cewa akwai wasu wurare da ba za a iya kaiwa gare su ba yayin da ake aikin ceto don kokarin ganin an kwaso motoci da kuma rayukan wadanda suka salonta a karkashin kasa. Wani jami'in hukumar Agaji ta Red Cross ya bayyana cewa a yanzu haka ana a yanzu haka muna daga cikin wuraren fakewa da aka samar a birnin Valencia bayan barkewar an ba liyar ruwan. Minister Kasar Pedro Sanchez ya bukaci mutane da su zauna a gida sannan kuma su kiyaye da shawarun da masana harkokin ceto suka bayyana a kasar. To anan kuma mutumin kirar shugaban kasar 
anan kuma mutumikin shugaban kasar Amurka Kamala Harris ta dauki idan ta karar shugaban kasa na jami'ar Republican Donald Trump kan kudurin sa na san kara mata ko suna so ko ba su so kamar yadda dan takarar ya bayyana da take jawabi kafin fara yaki neman zabe a jihohin muhimmancin kasar uwar gida Harris ta bayyana a kalaman na abokin takarta a matsayin na rashin dacewa ta bayyana cewa ratsa wannan shugaban Amurka ya zai cewa zai iya yanke hukunci kan abin da ya kamata mata su yanke hukunci da kansu kuri'ar jin ra'ayin jama'a da aka yi ta nuna cewa za a fafata wannan zabe ne da kankan kan to annan kuma tajirin dan kasa Elon Musk ya gaza bayyana a gaban kotu dake Pennsylvania domin fuskantar tuhumar tuhume game da kyautar dala miliyan 1 gabanin yin zaben shugaban kasa a kasar Amurka a maimakon haka dai lawayoyin a tajirin sun nemi a mayar da shar'ar karkashin kotun tarayya wanda hakan ka iya jinkirta yankin hukunci har zuwa bayan zabe Elon Musk ya yi masu zabe ta yin kudi a jihohi marasa alkibla wato da suka hada hannu kan takardar da suka hada hannu kan takardar korafi da suka aike a kasar ta Amurka a nata bangaren ma'aikar shar'a ta yi gargadin cewa shirin na iya janyoyin karo da dokar zabe ta a kasar amma kuma kamata yi a zaman kotun a duba kokin cewa tsarin ya saba dokokin cikin gida na kasar ta Amurka to yanzu kuma ga Abdul Basir Haruna dauke da labarun wasanni yanda a cikin shirin make karanto muku labaran da muka wayi gari da su da ma sanar da ku yanda ke kasancewa musamman daga kansar sarga sannan guda biyar da ake buga a yankin Nahiya Ture gasar da ta hada da English Premier League gasar da ake buga kasar Ingila sai La Liga ta kasar Spain da gasar Bundesliga ta kasar Jamus sai gasar Ligue 1 ta kasar Faransa da kuma gasar nan ta Syria ta kasar Italia kamar yanda ku sani muka karanto muku labari da ma sakamakon wasan da ake bugawa anan gida Najeriya wato ga sannan ta mu wadda aka fusa da NPFL wato Nigeria Professional Football League muna ba ku hakuri da fara muku da highlight da muka yi sakamakon tsaikon da aka samu na rashin isowa wajen aiki da wuri da ne saboda wata matsala da na samu a hanya ta ta zuwa office hakan ne sa ban kasance da ku da wuri ba amma muna mu yasu ba ku hakuri kamar yadda ku sani masu kallon mu yawa muna dauke da labarai wanda zamu karanto su a gurguje domin ƙara ba ku da mu shigowa cikin shirin na fagin wasanni kamar yadda ku sani a uh, wanda ke nuna cewa wato sportin ta cimma wato matsaya kan barin kocin ta Miss Naru Ben Arif Amorin wato ya bar ko ya ya bar wato kungiyar ya koma kungiyar kwallon kafa ta Manchester United a uh, lokutan da ake ganin cewa uh, wadan watan na November wato uh, Ruben Amorin zai kasance da tawagar kungiyar kwallon kafa ta Manchester United a matsayin sa na sabon mai horaswa a uh, yayin da kuma kamar yadda ku sani wato dan wasan gabanar Sweden mai suna Victor Gregres a uh, to mai shekara 26 dan da dan wasan tsakiya na kasar Denmark Martin Hall uh, wato Holman mai shekara 25 ba za su yi dadin shawara amurin ba ta bari sportin bayan ya wato ya ya, ya sa sun amince da cigaba da kasancewa da kungiyar kwallon kafa a lokacin da kungiyar da dama su kai ta zawarta su wato lokacin da Victor Gregres ya so ya ba kungiyar wato uh, Ruben Amorin na kungiyar kwallon kafar ta Sporting wanda zai zama mai horo za kungiyar kwallon kafar ta Manchester United yana daya daga cikin mutanen da suka shawo kan shi suka je ce ya ci gaba da zama kungiyar kwallon kafar ta Sporting hakan yasa ya bayyana cewa ba su ji dadi ba na barin kungiyar da yake sanya yi da zai tafi ya fasu a uh, kuma nan wato sai dai wato idan muka duba kuma nan gaba dan wasan gaba na Bayern Munich <coughs> da Jamus mai suna Jamal Musiala mai shekara 21 ya amince ya zauna ya ya, ya amince ya zauna wato a hankali kwance a club din na Bundesliga duk da alakan tashi da kuma kungiyar kwallon kafa ta Manchester City da ake yi a wato jita jita da maganganu da take ta nuna cewa Muziala zai dawo Manchester City gashi da yanzu ya amince ya ci gaba da kasancewa da kungiyar kwallon kafa ta Bayern Munich wanda ke buga gasar ta Bundesliga wanda hakan nan cewa za a ba sa sabo kontra yi domin ya raftuka hannu domin cigaba da kasancewa da babban kungiyar da Vincent Company ke horaswa 
Anam Angaram kwa Manchester United na iya yung hamaya de Liverpool kanta masambaya na Wolf dan asalang kasa Algeria misuna Ryan Atnori Atnori watu meshe kara ashinda uku Liverpool la tu de Manchester United sa si Gugaya akan Ryan Atnori watu meshe kara ashinda uku wanda na masani dan asalang kasa watu Algeria Anam Angaram kwa bo Brent Fozata buka chifam milian si tenkan na masanga bana kamaru misuna Brian Umbemu Meishe kera shinde ber a ka suwara musayar en masa a watan jeneru ya enda itama unjar kwa langafata asana teke chiga bada a zawata watu Brian Mbwemu daga unjar kwa langafata Brentford. Brentford dita chiga duwande ike buka ata da masa watu fam milian se tenze biya du nunse ya mwana da masa. Anam mangwela mkwa Steven Gerrard na fuskantar watu kuradaga kuradaga watu mkami sana coaching ala itafak bayanda unja ta Saudiya ta yereshin nasara aga sarchun kopin gasar da aka yi a makonnan watu Steven Gerrard na fuskantar masala na watu ala mchua di yaresa ahikin sa sabra unja ala wala ngafa ta ala itafak watu ta na fuskantar masala ta yereshin nasara wanda haka nisa ikit na nchua da iya salama Steven Gerrard a matsayin mai horas da ita yayin da ake gan cewa za ta so ta sabon ta sabon mai horas wa a nan bangaren ku Aston Villa na tattaunawa da dan wasan gaban England mai suna Morgan Rodgers mai shekara 23 kan sabuwar yarjejeniya wato Morgan Rodgers dai dan wasa ne da yake takalli da kungiyar kwallon kafar ta Aston Villa wanda kuma yana kokari hakan yin sa suke to su sabon ta kontra gin sa a nan bangaren ku Real Madrid na tunan dauko dan wasan tsakiyar Faransa mai suna Aurelien Chouameni mai shekara 24 wato kuma da ka ji Real Madrid na tunanin dauko dan wasan tsakiyar Faransa wato Aurelien Chouameni mai shekara 24 wato ana ganin cewa wato dan wasan na wato Real Madrid wannan labarin dai kamar akwai kuskure a cikin shi wanda ake nuna cewa wato wata kungiya ce dai take bukata Aurelien Chouameni daga kungiyar kwallon kafan ta Real Madrid a nan bangaren ku wato Real Madrid za ta biya fam million 84 dan sai Enzo Fernandez ko kuma ta ba Chelsea Chouameni a matsayin wani bangare na cikin dan wasan tsakiyar na Argentina mai shekara 23 kundi ji wato Real Madrid tana bukata Enzo Fernandez ko kuma ta mika Aurelien Chouameni ga kungiyar kwallon kafar ta Chelsea a matsayin musa yan wasa a lokacin da suke bukatar wato Enzo Fernandez a nan bangaren ku Barcelona na sa ido kan na sa na sa ido kan Linda Rafelio ke ciki a AC Milan and uh, nufin wato daukar dan wasan na kasar Portugal a uh, watan Janeiro a uh, lokacin da ake ganin cewa lokaci ne da ake kawo sababbe yan wasa da ma karin ta sabon ta kungiyar sababbe yan wasa kamar yanda ku sani masu kallon mu a gurguje wannan shine labarin da za mu kawo muku a cikin safiya yau kamar yanda na ba ku haguri na rashin kasancewa da ku da wuri da bamu yi ba wanda kamar yanda ku sani a uh, gobe akwai wasannin da za a buga na gasar ta Premier League wanda idan muka duba gobe <coughs> rana asabar akwai wasan da za a buga uh, na gasar Premier League wanda Arsenal za ta karbi uh, Newcastle za ta karbi wancin Arsenal karfe 1 da rabi a gobe yayin da Burnley maza su kara da Man City, Ipswich da Leicester City, Liverpool da Brighton, Nottingham Forest da West Ham United, Southampton da Everton yayin da Wolf za su karbi wancin Crystal Palace a uh, idan muka duba ranar lahadi kuwa akwai wasu wasannin da za a buga musamman yau da yau wato a kwararren lokaci zaba ya gaya muku duka wasannin da za a buga ba a uh, ga sama taron gida Nigeria El Kanemi Warriors za ta kara da Katsina United ABI Warriors za ta kara da Hadland of Wiri Aqua United da Kwara United yayin da Bayer Sarra suka duba kuncin Eyimba dan Gurenja za su kara da Nasara United wato Ikurudu City za su kara da kungiyar kwallon kafan nan ta Rivers United FC Kano Pila za su kara da Plateau United a uh, nan je tunaro da Sushin Stars uh, Sunshine Stars da Bendal Insurance yayin da kuma Raymond Stars kara da kungiyar kwallon kafan nan ta Lobby Stars to madalla an gaida Abdulbasir Hanu da labaran wasanni da haka ne kuma ku kawo ƙarshen labaran da rahoton da muke dauke da su a cikin taskar ta mu sirretin da farkon shirin kun ciro majalisar tattalin adaski ta kasa ta shawarci shugabatun bude da dakatar da Harajin Bat babu wahalar samun mai daga matatar mu inji Ali Kodangwati ba mu ji duriyar manoma 21 da yan bindiga suka sace a jahar Kebe ba in ji wasu manoma
accompanying NNPCL bai ba mu izinin bayar da lalamman fitar kai tsaye ba in ji mata tare Aliko Dangwati A bangaren labaran kasashen waje za ku yi cewar an kama shahararru masu amfani da shafukan yanar gizo a kasar Tunisia Tajiri a kasar Amurka Elon Musk ya ki bayyana a gaban kotu kan tuhumar bayar masu zabe cin hanci na makudin ku. To da haka kuma zan yi ban kwana da ku a madan dukkanin yan uwa abokan aiki da suka tallafa mu wajen ganin dukkanin labaran da rahotunin sun zo muku. Ni Yahya Hassan iya take cewa mu kwana lafiya.